New at 8, Scandal is rocking the new PlayStation 4 Sony video game system after a man uses it to broadcast naked images of his wife online. Now, I want to warn you here in a minute, you're going to see video that is graphic, so if you have kids in the room, you might want to remove them. So this incident is really disturbing people, and, uh, you know, they're saying that it may change the landscape of the gaming industry. The live online PS4 stream started with this man drinking on this couch with his wife. She eventually passed out. After a while of semi-innocent messing around with her, he took her shirt off and exposed her breasts for about 15 minutes. Anyone tuning in could see her naked top half during that period of time. Then the video stream went dark. After about 10 minutes or so, it came back and she is completely naked still sleeping, presumably stripped by the husband. The name of the couple is not known. They have not come forward. It's completely possible that the woman has no idea this even happened. All we know is this man's gaming handle. The PS4 comes with a camera that people generally point toward their living room for various interactive gaming or video chatting. What's new here is Twitch TV added channels for the new PS4. Twitch is a live streaming video network for gamers. Typically, it is used to broadcast live gaming. People watch other people playing their favorite games. Competitions and tournaments can also be played through Twitch. This incident abused the system and let this twisted, sick porn or sexual abuse go live to whoever wanted to tune in. Twitch did a great job immediately responding to this and has banned the man from Twitch who did this. They also told their users they will have a zero tolerance for anything broadcasted other than innocent gaming. But there is a larger problem here. There's really no way to prevent such content from getting out there in the first place. And of course, this worries parents of young gamers who now have access to this new form of live self-broadcasting. Gabe Slate, Cron4 News.